Hey, what is up guys? At Jason this back. Today we're going to be talking about the brand new Air Jordan Mid that is coming out next Saturday, which is November 30th. This one is a collaboration with Mason Chateau. This Air Jordan is actually a mid, which is not the greatest thing ever. I mean, mids aren't bad. I mean, I like them. Like I said, I like them personally, but a lot of people don't like them, and y'all know that. Um, but the colorway, let's talk about the colorway first. So the colorway is crazy. And that's on period. Bitch. So it comes with red stitching on the top with a yellow Air Jordan tag. And now let's talk about the colorways on the bottom. So it comes in a nice cream, brown, yellow, blue, and cream, you know, color, you know? You know what I'm saying? So, I, I like it. It looks really nice, and I, I love the pattern. Like, on the Nike logo, you can see the squiggly pattern. Um, let's jump into the history of the shoe. I'm reading this online. So, taking its name from Paris Multicultural Chateau Rouge neighborhood, Meissen Chateau Rouge is inspired by African heritage and the gathering of multiple cultures. The mixture of colors and textural patterns on this Air Jordan Mid represents this richness and diversity. So, all the colors and patterns are supposed to represent the richness and diversity in African heritage, basically. And I like it. It looks like a really nice shoe. So now that we know a little bit about the history of the shoe, let us hop on to the retail and the resale for these. So retail price is $130, a normal Air Jordan 1 mid would be at. Um, in the resale right now, it is actually sitting at a $226 mark at a size 8. Um, I was actually doing a little bit of investigation on these shoes, um, comparing prices on Goat and StockX and other resellers. And... Actually, the higher the sizes, the much more money you're getting. But I don't know if that's going to be true for all. But I'm looking into a size 8, and right now it's sitting at 226. Compared to a size 10.5, it's 255. Compared to a size 12, $270. Compared to a size 12.5, okay, 136. <laughs> but compared to a size 13, a size 13 is going for $400 right now. But... I'm pretty sure that these are either gonna go a little bit lower in price. So let's talk about resale predictions. Um, I'm not 100% sure, obviously. I feel like these aren't gonna break. These will still have some value. And if they do break, I really feel like you're still gonna be able to get at least 30 or $40 profit from these. Right now they're like a 250, 260, so you're getting like a really nice deal right there with a hundred dollars profit um i do i do predict that they will drop a little bit in price once they release and the stock of these shoes also depend i don't know the stock uh there's people who always people who always know the stocks but i don't know how people find out the stock of a shoe can't find it anywhere so it depends on how limited the shoe is Depends the colorway, depends collaboration too. So, it's really hard to judge on these shoes, man. But I feel I feel like they're gonna do all right. I think that's the best terms. They're gonna do all right. Go for a size eight, seven, nine, ten. I feel like those are gonna be your money shoes for sure. Cause right now they're sitting at a pretty decent price. Um, and obviously, if you, if you want them for a personal, always cop them, man. Always cop them. So, profit on these shoes, I feel like a safe, safe profit right now is $100. Low profit is $50, and high profit is $150 to $200. If the shoe does really well. If the shoe breaks, I will feel like you'll get $30, $20 at least. I mean, it's... I know it's lunch money, but it's still something, right? And if they do break, you can always return your shoes, so you don't really lose on money besides shipping. So you do, so you do lose ten dollars, but not you don't lose a hundred and thirty dollars. You feel me? Um, I think that's gonna wrap it up for today, guys. Um, I'm gonna ask y'all something. 
please leave in the comments any suggestions on like how I can make these videos better. Kind of just want to like, I don't know, I want to be different and I want to bring something more creative to these sneaker sneaker reviews. So like comment things that I can do to make it more interesting, you feel me? Um, you know, I'm, I'm open to anything, right? And um, if you guys leave a like on this video, it really helps out a lot. Don't forget to subscribe either because, you know, it helps out a lot too. Um, but yeah, like I said, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. It really helps a lot. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video.